Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm sharing with you four really simple and easy crock pot meals that you can use for the summer. I really enjoy doing crock pot meals in the summer because it helps keep my kitchen from getting hot. I have a gas stove and I just don't have the best circulation here in my kitchen and so when I'm using the stove, my kitchen gets really hot. So being able to use my crock pot every evening instead really saves us on our electricity bill, believe it or not. So I love all of these meals, they're really simple and easy to use, so I hope that y'all enjoy them and give them a try yourself. Okay, also for this first meal, I have lots of meat to choose from. I just got my butcher box in the mail, so there are lots of meats that I have to choose from for all of these videos, but I have decided for the very first meal, I'm going to be showing you all the pork chops, smothered pork chops. They're nice and creamy. You can cut it up, shred it, eat it like it is, or put it on rice or mashed potatoes. Super easy and convenient to get my butcher box in the mail. Really big announcement with butcher box. Anybody who signs up for butcher box this month with the link in my description box it's gonna get free bacon in their box today and for the rest of their life so I will leave all of the details for that in the description box along with the instructions and recipes for all of these meals as well all right y'all it is always a good day whenever butcher box arrives at my doorstep like I mentioned at the beginning of the video if you click the link in the description box and sign up for butcher box today you are going to get free bacon and free shipping in your box for the rest of your membership I love butcher box it is super convenient for me as a busy mom it arrives straight to my doorstep whenever I need it to. It's very flexible. You can change the delivery date to meet the needs of your life at the time. ButcherBox is a company that cares about animals and the planet and the livelihood of farmers, and I very much support their mission. All of their meat is 100% grass-fed beef, free-range organic chicken, pork-raised, crate-free, humanely raised pork, wild-caught seafood, and their bacon is uncured, nitrate-free, and sugar-free as well. Don't forget to click the link in the description box to get yourself some free bacon in your first order and for the rest of your life. Sometimes when I'm thinking about us Before we got lost and we parted Back to back we would carry on then We'd do anything for what we started But this time we could break Okay, so for a side for this dish, I cut up some red potatoes. I really need to go to the grocery store, so I'm trying to make do with what I have. I'm gonna put some olive oil on it. I think I'm gonna put some parsley. I'm out of Uncle Chris's seasoning, which is my favorite, but I have this green goddess seasoning from Trader Joe's that I got like a month or so ago, and it smells amazing. Um, you can even make this dressing it's hard for y'all to see it has a recipe but it's basically minced onion salt garlic ground pepper chives dried green onion spinach powder lemon powder lemon juice so I'm gonna put this let's see let me see if I can open this with one hand we're gonna drizzle with olive oil Now we're gonna cook it at 450, uh, probably like for 30 minutes. All right, this is done. You can eat them like this or you can shred it and eat it over rice.
Okay y'all, for a really cheap side, I bought a small cabbage for 60 cents and here's a red onion. I like to throw in olive oil, you can do salt and pepper and whatever seasonings you want. So we're gonna cook this down and put some butter and it will be a yummy side uh, for this dish. Okay, so some reason my clip of me shredding the pork got deleted, but that's all that I did after it cooked all day. I took two forks and I shredded the meat. I love to use those little packs of slow cooking sauce that you can buy at Walmart or HEB or really any grocery store. That's the only thing I used on this pork and it was delicious. I just shredded it with two forks, drained some of the liquid. Okay, also for this meal, I have not made it in about a year. I really love it. Um, if you love Olive Garden, then you will love this meal. It's super easy. I actually had all of this stuff on hand. Um, and I'm just making it with what I have. So I hope that y'all enjoy this one. It's really good. All right, once your chicken cooks all day, all you're gonna do is boil one pound of pasta. I have elbow noodles. You can use pine pasta, bow tie pasta, whatever you would like. You're gonna boil it on the stove and then drain the water and add it into the crock pot. Give it a really good mix and then you can eat it just like it is. Top it with more Parmesan if you would like and you are done. Sonas on the line They wanna pick a fight with Okay, so this recipe is super easy. You're just gonna let this cook on high until the chicken is done. Shred it all really well. Then you're gonna take biscuits. I'm using the jumbo. You can use the regular and it's totally fine. You're just gonna place them on top of the mixture and put them nice and neat together. And then you're gonna take the ceramic pot out of the crock pot itself and you're gonna put it in the oven at 350 degrees i just looked at the directions on the biscuits themselves and then took them out whenever they were done and you are ready to eat i love real 
chicken pot pie and this is definitely not the same so I don't want you to be disappointed but it is a close second whenever you are in a hurry and in a rush and can just throw this together in a crock pot. Thanks so much for watching everybody. I hope that y'all enjoyed. Make sure to check out the link in the description box to give Butcher Box a try. You can click the link and get free bacon in every box for the rest of your life just by clicking the link and starting with Butcher Box today. It's really super easy and convenient. Also a great cause to support. You can get it straight to your doorstep. I will see y'all in our next video, everybody. Stay tuned for a summer morning routine. Also a clean my disgusting car with me video. We've got lots coming up this summer that you don't wanna miss. So make sure your notifications are on if they are not. And I will see y'all in the next video. Bye everybody.